What's going on everyone? We have some new updates for the character of Wonder Woman Diana Prince in the DCEU. Now during the Justice League press tour in China that happened over the past couple of days, Gal Gadot was talking about the character in depth more as interviewers were asking her questions about where her character is in the film and the previous films like Batman v Superman where we first saw her introduced and we got a little bit of her backstory and history in that film. But it seems like things have actually changed ever since the solo Wonder Woman film and more specifically in regards to Diana's decision to give up on humanity and only decide to join the battle after very careful consideration that we saw in BVS. So when she was asked the question why did she give up on humanity and everything she says quote we realize that actually there is no way that Wonder Woman will ever give up on mankind. The reason why she left the island was because she wanted to make their lives better and safer. They are her calling. So I'm giving you a very honest answer. Sometimes in a creative process you establish something that is not necessarily the right decision, but then you can always correct it and change it. So Wonder Woman will always be there as far as she concerns for mankind. Which is something that was interesting because at the end of the actual Wonder Woman solo film, there was a little tease that basically showed that Diana was still in Man's World even after World War One, the loss of Steve Trevor, and the things that she saw in Man's World, the atrocities of war. Even after seeing all of that she still didn't give up on mankind and she glides over uh, London at the very end of the film so that was kind of an interesting thing people are kind of confused because like I said in BVS she basically says oh well I've been away for hundreds of years because I kind of just gave up on mankind and now they're saying well we're kind of just retconning that and pretending that didn't happen because Wonder Woman would never give up on mankind and that's why a lot of people are confused kind of after seeing BVS and the decision story-wise that was made so I'm glad that they're course correcting that and pretending like it didn't actually happen and just going forward with the origin that she did stick around because it also helped explain what she was doing in Wonder Woman 2 which is supposedly set during the Cold War and dealing with the Russians so that should be a very interesting story I can't wait to see what they're going to do with it but leave your thoughts down in the comments below do you guys buy or sell this retcon instead of making it so that Wonder Woman left mankind she actually stuck around for the long haul Drop all your thoughts down in the comments below, and for more updates on Wonder Woman 2 and the future of the DCEU, be sure to subscribe to Hybrid Network. Thanks again for checking out this video. If you want to get even more updates from us, be sure to follow our social media platforms, check out our website for the latest breaking news and editorials, and if you want to see our content improve, donate to us on Patreon for exclusive rewards.